All right, I'm going to show the proof now that Robert Breaker stole his information from Peter Ruckman. I don't believe he went down there to learn the Bible. I think he went down there to learn how to steal Ruckman's material and bring it out as his own on his channel. I'm going to show you the proof of that. Right here you see this chart that Peter Ruckman is drawing. If you're familiar with Robert Breaker, it should start looking familiar. But let's watch a little bit of this. When you read your Bible, always make a distinction between a prayer when a man is saved by grace through faith in the finished work of Christ, and a period of time with a combination of faith and works necessary for salvation, where a man does not dare take the mark of the beast or his number, and a period of time when Christ comes to reign, where nobody is saved by faith because they can see Christ right there. There's nothing to believe on them by faith because the Lord will be right there on the ground reigning. Now this is a very brief sample, as we said. And if you'll stick with us and watch the drawing, we'll show you more of the same. This is just a very brief sample to show you how the Word of God has proper divisions, and they're drawn out. All false teaching and false doctrine comes from taking a verse here and putting it here, or a verse here and putting it there, or a verse there and putting it there. When you put the verses in the right place, no verse in the Bible contradicts. Thy word is true from the beginning. And every one of our righteous judgments endures forever. Okay, so let me just pause it right there. Right, you can basically see the basics of. Dr. Ruckman's drawing here. I'll just come back to here. All right. You can see cross here. He has Old Testament, the little thing drawn like that. Here's the church age. It goes here. Arrow goes up. This comes back down. He has Great Tribulation written there. Millennial 1000 reign. The whole deal. All right. Look at Robert Breaker. Does it look a little familiar here? There, there, up, down. Once in a while he'll do a little bit different variation of it, but up, there, 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 there. He just draws the same thing that he stole from Ruckman over and over and over again. There, 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 there. Again, there. He's drawing it there, there. Look at that. Every single, nearly every single one of this faker's videos. It's the same chart. One chart that he stole from Ruckman over and over and over again. He's a fraud, people. He said, oh no, he was taught at PBI. He was, he was taught there. Ruckman kicked him out. Because Ruckman knew that the guy was a fake. He was a fraud. Peter Ruckman kicked Robert Breaker out of the place. Said Robert Breaker's interested in one thing, and that's Robert Breaker. Said, again, again, I showed the proof of that in video. Look at that. I mean, it just... And you go way on back through here and things... Let's keep going back. It's the same chart over and over and over again. But see, it's kind of a theme with Robert Breaker. Because not only did he steal Peter Ruckman's material, he also stole salvation, according to him. You don't ask to be saved. You take salvation. And he says, well, it's, it's trusting the gospel and, th and things. You know, he says about it's, you know, here, perverting the gospel and whatever else. If you pray to be saved, if you call upon the name of the Lord to be saved, you're lost. You didn't make it. You just, you take salvation. is what you do. That's what Robert Breaker teaches. The guy is a complete lying hypocrite. And you get down through a lot of his uh, sermons that he preaches. Uh, it's just stuff that he steals from Ruckman. Again, you know, go up here. You can see behind him, Ruckman commentaries and Ruckman books and things. So this fraud here, this lying fraud, he goes to Ruckman's, you know, Pensacola Bible Institute, and he's learning things, and he gets messed up doctrinally, and Ruckman, they kick him out down there, and then he comes here to YouTube, and he puts, I mean, you can just take, I could take any one of those books back there, open it up, read the what Ruckman has to write, make some sermon notes off of that, plagiarize it, in other words, and just come out, and hey, this is my stuff. That's what Robert Breaker is. Robert Breaker is a fraud. He's a fake. Ruckman never taught the plan of salvation that Breaker taught.
That's one of the big reasons he got kicked out down there. Don't listen to him. Don't follow him. He's in this whole thing for the money. Guaranteed. That's why he's monetized. Alright? That's going to be it. Thank you for watching.